DPS troopers have had to reinspect more than a thousand school buses after finding problems with the way that one of the troopers did his job. Now that trooper is no longer with DPS. Team 12's William Pitts has more details on what happened that has school districts asking if their buses were inspected correctly. Every school bus has to be inspected every year in order to stay on the road. But DPS says one of the troopers doing the inspections may not have been doing his job. So this is the safety inspection sticker. And without that sticker, the bus doesn't roll. Cecilia Sanchez is in charge of transportation for the Cartwright School District. Every year, a DPS trooper comes by and goes over the buses. We start in the front looking at the windshield wipers, the lights, the uh, moving around the side, the tires, uh, the lug nuts, the brakes. They hold us accountable uh, for the regulations, so they ensure that we are keeping up with all the regulations when it comes to keeping our students safe. To think that they weren't done correctly, knowing that it's a two-man process at least, that, I mean, that's a real concern. DPS says one of its troopers, Steve Powers, may not have done his inspections up to the department standards. DPS isn't saying what that means or how they found out about it. The only thing they'll say is that they got an allegation that Powers was misusing his department car, and the investigation revealed some sort of problems with Powers' bus inspection. They say Powers may have committed criminal violations. <laughs> And because of that, DPS had to reinspect 1,294 buses, all in the Phoenix metro area. But a DPS spokesman wouldn't say which school districts were impacted. Cartwright says its buses are fine. It's a real concern. And so I know the first thing I did was ask our Department of Transportation, you know, make sure who has been conducting our inspections. And thankfully it wasn't him. A DPS spokesman says there was never a concern over the safety of the buses that they had to reinspect. But Powers is still under criminal investigation. DPS says he quit before he could be fired. William Pitts, 12 News.